lot of you are giving the enemy your cheat code. And I'm going to say this, so stay with me. The Bible says there's life and death in the power of the tongue. The Bible also says the enemy goes to and fro, seeking whom he may devour. He also says the enemy comes to kill, steal, and destroy. So because the enemy is the prince of this world, he's in your conversations. He's in your the words that you speak. He's in your plans. He's in your dreams if you say them, saying them out loud. He's in all of those moments, and he is cunning, the Bible tells us. So in this season... I feel led to say this in this season, be careful what you say without authority, because the enemy is going to use the very words you say to try to build snares and traps to deter you from your goals, to distract you, to keep you away from the things that are in you. All the things that God wants to birth in you, be careful about seeing them without authority. Be careful of your plan, seeing them vainly, because the enemy is wanting to take away those moments where you're like, well, I want to be successful in this. The enemy hears you and he's going to he's going to go tell his, hey, she want to be successful in this. Go distract her with da 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 da. And maybe that'll get her to turn her face from God because she didn't get the opportunity. He didn't get the opportunity. Be careful with your words in this season.